So I just started adding some French knots to some of the new embroidery kit designs. Uh, if you are not interested in doing French knots, it's not a big deal. Just put a little seed stitch over top of the printed area and no one will know the difference. But if you're ready to try out French knots, it's uh, not that hard. It just, it's a little different from most stitches because you're in, you're going to be using both of your hands. So you wanna, you're going to want to work at a table or use a hoop stand. So I am right-handed. So I'm going to have my needle in my right hand and I'm going to hold the thread that's coming out. Well, I missed a step. You're going to put your needle through the back and pull your thread through. So needle in right hand, hold on with a little bit of tension with your left hand and then wrap your needle one, two, three times. So you see they're wrapped around sort of the middle of my needle. Then I'm gonna bring the point of my needle back to where the fabric is coming out of the, I mean the thread is coming out of the fabric and pull with my left hand, right? And then keep, don't let go of the, fab, the thread with your left hand. So I, I usually put my finger on the edge of the hoop and then take your right hand, push this needle down a little bit halfway. My right hand, pull from behind, make sure that oh, you're not too tight or you won't be able to get the needle through. All right, so pull it and then you should be able to just let go. And that's it. So let's try that one more time. See if I had beginner's luck. <laughs> Pull it from behind. This is my left hand. Oops, sorry. All right. And then one, two, three. Pull, and it'll, the knot will go down to the... You, did you see how it slid down the needle? All right, I'm still holding on with my left hand. I'm going to secure it and go back behind here with my right hand. Pull my needle through until the majority of the thread has gone through. And then you can let go and tighten it. Okay? If you have any questions or anything, just email me and I'm happy to help. I hope you have fun with your French knots.